also like I look at my baby boy baby girl isn't she adorable yeah I, I switched races because I was like I wanted to be a bunny for a really long time, okay? And then I was like, no, we're gonna finish Stormblood with my actual character. Because, like, when I made my account, I couldn't choose the bunny type because, like, I was on the free trial and they didn't let you choose Bun Bun deck then. So, um. So, yeah. I'm the cutest bunny now. So, let's go in. I don't care about hats. I know a bunch of people already told me I can't wear hats. Did I ever wear a hat? No, I did not. I don't care about them. I wanted to be the hot bunny girl, okay? I am the hot bunny girl now. And I love it. So, I don't know why I'm in front here. I need to go here. The fashion is the thing I got from Tama. I love it. I love the jacket. I wish I had the jacket in real life. Look how cool the jacket is. I love it. It's the thing Tama gave me. So we need to go in here. We left off. Everyone is sleeping. I'm the only one who woke up. And um, yeah. That, that, that's it, I think. I was depressed. Hi, Tatari. Good news, Nix. We've had a stroke of luck in our search for the beacon. Oh, yeah, and I'm looking for a tower now, don't I? <laughs> because, like, I was, like, in this mind palace of the weird dude who I don't know who it is at, and he was like, hey, just go look for a tower. So I'm looking for that now, don't I? Apparently our colleagues have stumbled across a hidden path leading down into the hollows around the base of the crystal tower. A path I doubt we'd ever have found had the ironworks and the suns not... And the suns? And the suns? And the suns? Not added their numbers to the party. Thanks to them, we have an eager eye aplenty down there, checking under rocks and peering into every nook and cranny. Still, it sounds like there's a lot of ground to cover. Then we better go and give them a hand. <laughs> My thoughts exactly. The sooner we find this beacon, the sooner you can travel to wherever it is this mysterious voice is coming from. And the sooner we can work out how to help our friends, we have to find a way to wake them up. And before the Empire comes calling again, meaning we have no time to... Oh yeah, and we talk with the Emperor dude, who uh, has very weird motivations. Yeah, I remember that one. And there is a boat in North Silver Tier, waiting to ferry people out to the side, so let's be on our way. Oh wait, you coming? That's a new sound. That was a very unexpected quest sound. Oh, uh, we need to go to... No. W where is that? Okay, let's go there. Is that where I am? No, it's not. I, um... I'll be honest, I did not have the time to, like, collect all the... side quests so that I can fly in most regions yet. I... I truthfully apologize for that. I apparently have it here, that's awesome. So we're just gonna use that. Why am I so zoomed in? So... Nope. Nope. Here. Hello! Heading to the survey side, madam. It's on the eastern shore of the lake, and the swiftest way to get there is by boat. Yeah, I... I am aware of that, so let's go.
Look how many people there are. A bunch of them. Should we get to it then? Pick up anything that seems the least bit device-like, and we'll make ourselves a pile. Well, if it isn't the hero of the hour, maybe you'll change our look. We've found bugger all without you. Big sled! Hi. Aye, aye. But we could hardly say no to a call for aid from the Scions. Jesse call it the chief of some other business. So we'll be working twice as hard to make up for his not being here. Thrice as hard, even. Oh, thank you, both of you. I, I haven't heard their voices in, no in so long, I'm so confused. I'm not seeing anything out here. Do you reckon you could squeeze in there, Wedge? And get stuck halfway? No, thank you. I could try if you like. I would like to, to Tartar we go. To Taru, no. We couldn't ask you to do that. Oh, I'll be fine. This receptionist is not afraid to get I'm walking so slowly. What's going on? Look, it's crystals. Sorry, I, I meant to say, the scholars haven't finished their preliminary assessment of the site yet, so we're not supposed to venture too far in. But like, why can't I go in? Hmm. What's that you got there? Now that looks promising. It's your point, uh, Sasha. Isn't that the ironwork symbol? Counterfeiters? Now I have you. Uh, you are right. What's happening? What do you mean you have me? Stay with me. Focus on my voice. Let expanse contract. Eon become instant. Wait, this must be it. The device. Oh, this is supposed to happen. Is it supposed Throw to happen? Wide the gates that we may pass. Oh, they journey we? warrior. Of light. Focus on my voice. Let expanse contract. Eon become instant. Wait, this must be it. The device. An Ultima. There is no. I don't think there's an Ultima here. Did I did I die? Is is that the afterlife? Wait, is it? Oh no, it's Alfino. No, it's my friend. Do not look at me so. Like a few of them. This is one battle you cannot fight. It. Away with you! I love saying your spirited accounts always come as a welcome change. We did everything. Oh look, right. it's the glory of darkness. Everything that was asked of us, and still, still it came to this. Are we getting back to that story? I wish. I want to know more of that. It was so intriguing. Maybe? Oh, I hope so! I really like that storyline. Who's that? Your time has not yet come. She looks a bit like Monfilia. This was the afterlife, wasn't it? And the bitch was just like, you're not supposed to be here, goodbye. Go back.
I got Genesis. Do I need to read Loveless now at every turn? Be there with my book and just recite stupid things? I can't even fix my hair color. I can open up a, a Loveless wiki. I, I, I can read you passages out of Loveless if you want to. If that's what you want me to do. We can go ahead and do that. From endless dreams I awake. Urgent calls me to action once more. I'm in a night elf starting zone. I don't know what that means. Pick a book. Am I in the world that got destroyed from the Warrior of Darkness's guys? Because, like, they went back with Menphilia to that world to, like... Get it back? No, that's not him. Never mind. Ugh. Hello? Rare to meet someone out here who's not a peddler themselves. What brings you into the wilds this time of night? I fall asleep and suddenly I was here. I don't know, man. Things happen. What do you mean? This time of night. <laughs> My hair well, if it ain't the oldest joke in the book. My granddad, God rest his soul, used to tell that one to the barman a kicking out toy. And when, pray tell, did we last have a dark night? You rotten old drunk, ye, he replied. So the sun never goes down, okay? Yeah. I mean, everything is in this purple hue, so... Over a hundred bleeding years ago, that's when. <laughs> Are we in his world? Is this how we are? <laughs> you got that look down to a T. I'd almost think you meant it. Ah, got to you, did they? Poor beggar. That explains it then. Who got to me? Oh, no, I, sh I shouldn't drink. No, I really shouldn't drink. <laughs> Thanks for the offer, though. Well, I've roads to travel and wares to sell, but you, you best hurry along to the town nearby. Just head east through the trees and aim for the shining tower. You'll find the place soon enough. Tis the biggest settlement tower. for miles around. Go on now, friend. They'll take good care of you in the Crystarium. It's, it's not ominous at all. I don't have an evil twin, I am the evil twin. It rises, the gleaming spire. Its tip threatening to pierce the blinding canopy. There, it will all begin anew. Between dark and light. The pure and the corrupt. The one true struggle.
Am I supposed to know the voice who's talking to me? Like the voice actor? Hmm. I just have to find out? Of course I have to find out. So we're gonna do just in a second. Welcome to Shadow Ringers! Yay! Okay. Is are the sound levels okay for you guys? Can you hear everything well enough? Okay, it's a complete new area. That's awesome. So, where do I have to go? To the crystal thingy there, don't I? Okay. Let's walk. I, I can't even use my... My companion. Okay. It's a voice I have. Is it? But is it a voice I heard before? Like he was like in my mind. That's the question. I mean, I'm still waiting for like the red-haired cat boy to come back. Did we seal him in a crystal thingy? He has to be relevant at one point in the story, doesn't he? It's been like ages. When did I do that in Around Reborn? In between, somewhere there. He has to come back at one point, doesn't he? Halt. Another bunny! Oh, she pretty. All the bunnies are so pretty. Every face in this city I know. Yours, I do not. Yeah, I, 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 I come from very far away. This is the threshold of the Crystarium, stranger, and I am its gatekeeper. If you would enter, you will answer my questions. Ask a question. So far you didn't. From where do you hail? That's a hard question to answer because I don't know where here right now is. The source. I'm being cryptic. I'm coming from the source. The source? What is this cryptic nonsense? <laughs> because she called me out. <laughs> Had you given me an honest answer, I would not have barred your way. We oh care no. little here for a person's place of origin. It but probably instead, would have been the same no matter what I choose as an art. And I will not suffer you to pass. Um. Oh, she's a dancer, isn't she? Yeah. Crystal shard? That one had eaten. It must have gulped down the whole hand. Ring and all. Oh, it was a ring. I thought it's a crystal shard. Hi, not he. Oh no. Oh, come on! Did we doom the poor guy? Everything all right, Captain? <gasps> That's the guy who was talking to us, wasn't it? Right? Just a stray sin eater, and a weak one at that. I see. Weak or not, we should be on the lookout for more. But I see you've met my guest. I will escort her to the Crystarium myself, if you've no objection. Another of your mysterious friends, is it? I should have known. Sorry. Oh, so all the Very others well. are here? I'll inform the others your guest is to be given the run of the city. Pray forgive my less than cordial welcome. May the rest of your stay with us be a pleasant one. I, I'm, sh I'm sure it will be very pleasant. I'm so tall. Come with me. I will answer whatever questions you have when we are somewhere more private. How about you tell me your name? You show me your face.
Right then, before we plunge into the where's and wherefores, let me first thank you for answering my summons. It was definitely because I wanted to. I had intended to bring you directly to my personal oh. quarters, but I fear my aim was slightly off. That you are still able to make the crossing unharmed is a great relief. Wait, 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 wait. I could have died? <laughs> wait, what? And so, we come to the question of where. The realm in which you now find yourself belongs to one of the 13 reflections or shards. The first, to be precise, even if its inhabitants are largely oblivious to the fact. So it is one of the worlds that probably got this. Is it the world? Do we know which one the Warrior of Darkness came from? Was it the first one? As to wherefore, having been awarded the rather grandiose title of Crystal Exarch, <laughs> I, in uh, my capacity as caretaker of the Crystarium, thought to seek the aid of you and your companions. Do you have any idea how much fucking trouble you caused? You can't just abduct us from our world. An inkling, yes. I can only beg your forgiveness. Mm. Matters here forced my hand. But all shall be explained in due course, I promise you. Sure I will. Let us begin with the glaring skies up above. Here in the first, the world has been all but consumed by primordial life. I was already sassy at like the end of Poor Stoneblood. I got already really sassy there. I like that. Give my character some says. It began a century ago, by this realm's reckoning. A luminous flood swallowing everything in its path. More than nine tenths of this star was lost. Wow, that, that's a lot. And the fortunate few who survived are hounded by abominations born of that catastrophe even now. Sin eaters, we call them. The creature you saw earlier was one such monstrosity. Mm. It was to save the first from this menace that I learned to bridge the rift between worlds. That I might call upon the aid of the greatest of heroes. And though it meant depriving a world of its champion, I had to try. For in saving the first, you would bring salvation to the source as well. Isn't your world the first? Wait, I'm confused. What manner of host harangues his guests in the middle of the road? Let us continue our talk within the Crystarium. <laughs> oh, it's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. The update isn't big, though. It's just 600 megabytes. Can you give me a name, please? Or a face? Something where I'm like... A face would help me more than a name, to be fair. I'm shit with names. That I kind of know where you are. <laughs> it's not a nice thing to say, baby. His name is not Seymour. I'm concerned about his hand. Or like, about his neck. city the sole sanctuary for the living in a world all but resigned to oblivion each stone was laid with hope the town itself a symbol a monument to defiance in the face of death no would-be hero could fail to answer its call for who among us does not yearn for salvation? I 
I, I have a bad feeling about crystals since 16, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's just... Gives me a bad vibe! Hi there. And here we are, welcome my friend to the... Izo! <laughs> Thank you! Happy birthday, my dude! Why are you gifting me shit when you, it's your birthday? Holy shit! Hi, baby! Welcome! Thanks so much, Izo! I hope you're having a wonderful... <laughs> Week Andy donated one. Thank you, gifts. Andy. Star operator L. Star operator. Thank you, thank you. And here we are. Welcome, my friend, to the Crystarium. I think I like the new quest completion sound. I think I like it. Now, a full and frank discussion on the privacy of my study would seem to be in order. But I think our conversation would be more meaningful where you first to gain a firmer grasp of the situation here. To that end, I would like you to visit a few of the Crystarium's civic leaders and glean something of this world and its predicament. You like the I don't like the one from Storm. <laughs> Sasha, <laughs> just a second, okay, let, let me finish this one. As you can see, this path will take you directly to the Ephorite, the convenience of which I am sure you are only too familiar. Being the rightful object of my summoning spell, you should in theory be able to reach all the way back along your Ephoric trail and find a connection in the source, believe it or not. I strongly suggest you complete this attunement before venturing any for Okay, I will! The Etherite is pretty, though. After you have done so, walk up the steps next to the Etherite and head out to the left to arrive in the Crystalline Lane. This is where you'll find our collective of crafters and gatherers, as well as their spokeswoman, Ketlis, one of the people I should like you to meet. Another is Morin, to reach him in this cabinet of curiosity. The one to avoid the aforementioned steps, take the exit on the left and simply continue straight along down until you come to the large doors at the end of the path. Okay, the game this time is like here. This is exactly where you have to go. You can't tell me you're lost anymore. <laughs> the third and final person I should like you to meet is Bragi. That's a Kingdom Hearts character! That's from Kingdom Hearts, excuse me. Our man in charge of trade and distribution. He is to be found in the market, which you can access from the opposite side of the Ephraim Plaza. In seeking out each of my colleagues, you will visit the, ma the mayor districts of the city and hopefully gain a feel for the place. Trust my reactions were simple enough. Crystal clear. <laughs> to the right and down to where? <laughs> no, very good. I can see the layout of the Crystarium owes more to historic necessities than planning. But I'm sure you'll learn its twists and turns before long. Can I not ask him about my friends? Like, are they here? Is it just. All of them are supposed to be here, don't they? In all honesty, the true challenge may be finding the right way to approach its citizens. As you discovered during your encounters with the captain, the people of this world are unaware of the existence of the other stars and will struggle to accept the truth of your origin. My friends are just sleeping. They're fine. That being the case, when they ask when to hail, as they inevitably will, I suggest you claim to share a homeland with the Crystal Exarch. There is an unspoken rule here about peering too deeply into that particular mystery. Okay. Just lie to them. When you finish marking the rounds, pray meet me in the large courtyard at the center of the town. Till then. You still didn't tell me your name! That's pretty rude! 
Okay, I, I need to do squats. Is it 10? Is it 15? I don't remember. How many did I put in there? Where is it? 10. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me get up. No sun. No, what? That's his fault! I will forget about it! I will forget about it if I don't do it. That's on you. If I forget about it, that's on you and not on me, okay? So. Let's go on a tune because like we were highly, strongly advised to do it. Let's go, let's go. You can't even do anything else. It tells you to go here. I'm attuned. By focusing your senses, you detect the flare of vastly distant currents of ether. The connection to these energies is faint, but stable, and should allow teleportations to ether rights in the source. Wait, this place is called the source now? Yeah, well. 